Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology Channel, and we have updates that are available for Windows 10 22H2. These are the monthly bug fixes that were released late yesterday and rolling out. So if you go and check out your updates, you will see that uh, a uh, updates available. If you don't, it will be it will not show up and will be installed only with Patch Tuesday in April. Uh, but if you do check for Windows updates, then it, they will show up and install. Uh, the uh, if you look at the update history here, you'll see that the update is the cumulative update preview, which is the bug fixing update that Microsoft calls update previews, and it's KB 503-5941 rolling out. I also got a .NET framework uh, this time around. So this is an update preview to .NET, which means it's also bug fixes for .NET. And uh, this is, of course, fixing a few things within the Windows 10 operating system. Uh, it also adds something that, um, well, first of all, it will pop up a fantastic message for a lot of you that are with systems that are compatible. If your system is uh, capable and um, of moving to Windows 11, you'll get a big pop-up on the screen that says that, hey, you can move on to Windows 11. Of course, you can just um, say no if you don't want it. The uh, other thing that it will add for some of you, and not everybody, I don't have them, but on the lock screen, you'll have widgets that now will be available. And you can disable that or play with that in the settings and go into the personalization tab. And if you go there and go to lock screen, some of you will be seeing a new feature called um, widgets. And you can remove widgets. You can just disable them and make sure that you don't have, um, you know, widgets or anything. Uh, all of that is there. I don't have that. I don't have it uh, available on my Windows uh, 10 PC right now. Not everybody will see it, but if uh, some of you do, you will see that uh, it is uh, there to uh, to add new features where the lock screen can have like weather, finance, uh, all sorts of things that can pop up. So it's there, and if you have no problems or no issues, you can just ignore it. It doesn't matter. And uh, it will, uh, anyways, be installed automatically with Patch Tuesday coming up in uh, April 9th, 2024. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.